A love for literal rocks is forming a bedrock of goodwill across Minnesota and Iowa. Enthusiasts Chase Anderson and Paul Kraft used their stone selling savvy to raise $30,000 to support toys for tots. Their business is known as Agate Dudes. KIMD News 3's Emma Estev is live in Rochester after the duo purchased a truck load of holiday gifts for kids across our area. Emma. Jess, yes, I am bummed. We actually just missed the two of them, but they were here in this parking lot with their 53 foot semi truck that was full of toys. And they told me that they spent over four hours in Target browsing the aisles, looking for a variety of different gifts to drop off at Toys for Tots chapters like this one behind me. And so this is their fourth year supporting Toys for Tots. Using their passion for rocks, the duo was donated 70 boxes of rocks for them to sell to other rock enthusiasts on their live stream auction just a few weeks ago. During the event, they earned over $30,000. They spent today picking out gifts for kids and enduring on a road trip through Minnesota, Iowa, and Wisconsin to distribute them. Their first stop was in Rice Lake, Wisconsin, before they headed to the Med City. They tell me what it means to be able to support such a large community. It's pretty wild that we've done this. This all started with a phone call only four years ago with one state in Iowa, and now we're to four, or three states this year, we're going to four states next, next year. year. And like I was saying, they're on a pretty tight schedule. So as we speak, they are in route to Mason City, Iowa. Live in Rochester, Emma Estep, KIMT News 3. Thank you, Emma. We have a link to the Agate Dudes Facebook page on our website, KIMT.com, so you can stay up to date on the rest of their travels.